Roger Williamson tragically lost his life in his second Formula One race due to severe organizational deficiencies. During the 1973 Dutch GP, in the eighth lap, Roger Williamson crashed into the guardrails. His March 731 flipped, slid across the track, and caught fire. David Pulley, who witnessed the accident, immediately stopped to help. Since the track marshals were not equipped with heat-resistant clothing, no one assisted him in attempting to put the overturned car back on its wheels. As the other drivers did not see Pulley's parked car, they mistakenly assumed that the burning vehicle was Pulley's and did not stop to provide help, as they could see him at the accident site. Bystanders called for help were prevented from entering the track by police officers with dogs. Williamson eventually died in his vehicle. His body was recovered only after the race had nearly finished without interruption. The race was not stopped, 